Hey, it's Tom Gallagher, the Videopreneur, and the first part of this video I sped up. Just wanted to give you a quick update or overview of all the welding that Lynn has been doing. And it was one of those things, like I've said in a couple other videos, you pull a string and or pull a thread and shit starts coming up unwound. So we had quite a bit and uh, of rust that we didn't anticipate, stuff that I had thought was already repaired. And then in this case, this is uh, some small rust in the uh, area that, around the windshield. So I, I got a light on my camera, I just turned it off so you can see it better, but there's a uh, hole there that um, is pretty weak. So Lynn wanted to weld it up. And so that's what he's doing in this video here. Just we're to the point now, we've got all this other rust repaired. And so we're now just trying to do some uh, small stuff, just trying to clean up and get ready to uh, put this this uh, cab in primer. So in this video, he created a small patch that he's welding from, welding from above, but he's holding it from behind. So it's kind of one of those things, you just don't have enough hands, you don't have enough uh, long enough arms. And Lynn's really uh, gifted and independent, so uh, I wanted to help, but he just asked me to stay out of the way, so I'm staying out of the way shooting video, trying to record this. So he's, he's holding up a piece of metal from behind, uh, underneath the dash that is part of the uh, windshield surround, and fixing that hole. So oh, <laughs> as soon as he <coughs> walks away here, I'll be able to do a close up. So there's there's actually two parts. It's kind of a stair step um, where the windshield lays against this part, the rubber is here, and then there's a hole at this part, and then there's a hole up in, in here as well. So <coughs> he's fixing the top part, and then he has to fix the bottom part. So just wanted to catch up on some of the videos. I've been kind of behind on the videos, and um, so we're getting caught up on that, moving forward, uh, but it really set us behind as far as our process. You know, we were hoping to be done by uh, Easter, and Easter's not a realistic uh, deadline now. So anyway, that's what this is. And in a second, he's going to be done here, and then I'll be able to get a tighter shot to show you what he just repaired and just part of the process. So thanks again for watching. Uh, appreciate it. If you like the videos, if they bring value, give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing, and I'll keep putting out the videos. But again, these videos are mainly to record the process so I can look back, and and uh, but also so it helps people that are in, in the same position they have the same type of repair or um, upgrade they're going to do on their truck and I've spoken to several different people that have done that so here I've sped the video back up the rockers really kicked our uh, kicked us in the tail uh, we weren't anticipating as much repair as we had to and I'm going to do another video here in a little bit that shows how much repair we had to do thanks again for watching check you on the next one